When I was eight, my grandparents and my aunt and I took a trip um, for two weeks during the summer. And it was kind of built around my grandfather going to um, a reunion for his uh, division that he was in the war with. Um, and so we went to Seattle and we went to kind of all around Washington State and we stopped into Idaho and, and stopped into Oregon. Just this kind of like two week road trip kind of after the main convention was over. And I remember lots of things about the trip, but one in particular, I remember we stayed at a friend of theirs house somewhere in Washington. I don't remember her name. I mean, these people were old and, and very remote from me. I, I, had n I was eight, I was the only one, you know, under 50. <laughs> and for two weeks, I was, you know, was there. And um, I, uh, the house, I just remember the walls were painted yellow. There were these kind of like giant lazy boys, um, or they seemed giant to me at the time. I remember I went to the bathroom and I somehow, I, I don't remember this, but the toilet paper unrolled itself completely when I was done with it. So later, I just remember my aunt very angrily pulling me aside from whatever was going on and taking me into the bathroom and pointing at the toilet paper roll, which was, you know, just this kind of like long sheet of toilet paper and then just sort of crumpled up you know, at the bottom, like folded up. And I, she gave me a whole lecture, but the final sentence was, I want you to roll this back up again so that it is perfect. Now, have you ever tried to roll, re-roll a toilet paper roll so that it is perfect? It's like impossible. And it just took me forever, I remember, standing in there doing that.